If he's as bad as you say, that half of this country is now supporting this person who could be the 47th president of the United States. Why is that happening? This is an election for president of the United States. It's not supposed to be easy. I know, but it's if not it's supposed as... to be. It, 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 it is not supposed to be so a cakewalk for So are they misguided? The fifty percent? Are they stupid? What, oh what God, is it? I would never say that about the American people. And in fact, if you listen to Donald Trump, if you watch any of his rallies, he's the one who tends to demean and belittle and diminish the American people. He's the one who talks about an enemy within, within, an enemy within, talking about the American people. Suggesting he would turn the American military on the American people. We asked that the question to the former president today. Harris Faulkner had a, a town hall, and this is how he responded. I heard about that. They, they were saying I was, like, threatening. I'm not threatening anybody. They're the ones doing the threatening. They do phony investigations. I've been investigated more than Alphonse Capone. He was the greatest oh, yes. <laughs> No, it's right. true. We don't no, even think of it. It's called weaponization of government. It's a terrible thing. So... Brett, I, I'm sorry, and with all due respect, that clip was not what he has been saying about the enemy within that he has repeated when he's speaking about the American people. That's not what you just showed. Well, he was asked no, about that no, specific... No, 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 that's not what you just showed in all no, fairness no, no. and respect you, to you. I'm telling you that was the question that we asked him. Uh, he didn't show that, and here's the bottom line. He has repeated it many times. Please roll the clip. The worst people are the enemies from within. The enemy from within. Those people are more dangerous, the enemy from within, than Russia and China. These people are, should be put in jail the way they talk about our judges and our justices. Now, if you had one really violent day, one rough hour, and I mean real rough. I think the bigger problem are the people from within. We have some very bad people. We have some sick people, radical left lunatics. And I think they're the big, and, and it should be very easily handled by, if necessary, by National Guard, or if really necessary, by the military. You and I both know that. And you and I both know that he has talked about turning the American military on the American people. He has talked about going after people who are engaged in peaceful protest. He has talked about locking people up because they disagree with him. This is a democracy. And in, in a democracy, the President of the United States, in the United States of America, should be willing to be able to handle criticism without saying he'd lock people up for doing it. And this is what is at stake, which is why you have someone like the former chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff saying what Mark Milley has said about Donald Trump being a threat to the United States of America.